Welcome to another recording with your preferred realtor, Adrian Hilton. So today we are in the sunshine city of Portmore. Not only are we in Portmore, but we are in Independent City. So the church on our left is the Miracle Open Bible Church that we just passed. And we're going to make that immediate left turn after passing the Miracle Open Bible Church. On our right, it's another church, which is the Church of Christ. Now that's another major landmark that you cannot miss the property. After passing the Church of Christ um, Church, we made that immediate right turn and then it's another right to the property. So what I'm going to show you today is actually two ways to get to the subject property at hand. Now the property is at pink building on the right hand side. However, I'm going to show you another entrance if you wish not to drive that way. If you continue along the main road and you make a left and you make the second left turn, you can enter on Arizona Avenue and travel up the road and again the property will be directly in front of you so welcome to lot 23 arizona avenue let's go the property the front of the property is about 10 feet away from the fence so it, it has it has the size or capability to fit another car right there now we are currently on the carport and the carport is roughly eight feet in in width and 16 in length so it can have or host a average size suv with ample space to walk around the vehicle We are currently on the veranda or extended um, veranda which is enclosed you know the veranda can be used for storage it can be used for a washroom um, whatever nature you want to, to, to occupy it as based on the fact that it is enclosed it gives you more space to do whatever you wish to do now we are in the living and dining area now the living and dining area is roughly 10 by 12 again um, the standard it is a standard unit with this the height of to the ceiling is about 10 feet again the average size um, unit for the older complexes in in our property i should say in portmore as you can see the the um, type of roof um, is that is the regular roof that what Matson and give and then we have the ceramic tiles there um as i can see the property is fully grilled and now we are in the kitchen area now the kitchen area was recently done um the older type cupboards and cabinets were thrown out and they are now um newly stocked or newly refurbished with tiles for the black for the backsplash so whenever you're doing any form of dish washing or whatever the tile can be there the tile is there actually to ease with the cleaning and your space for your fridge and now we are entering into the bathroom area now the bathroom is pretty narrow um with a standing shower or a bath i should say um with a glass door at the front to hold whatever splashes that may occur from showering in the living room is taking a look see just again so that's the entrance right there and we come into the living room area right here and the kitchen is directly in front of the living and dining and the bathroom is beside the kitchen now we are entering into the bedrooms now this is the bedroom area right here pretty standard again size roughly 8 by 10 on the smaller side but hey it's an average size unit as i told you guys
and to the back of the room you have the outside which is the yard space that most people are interested in because you know most of the properties in portmore they are joint but this one my friends has the yard space where you can do your addition now we are in room number two which should be considered to be the master bedroom and that's the church that we had passed it's right across um from the fence or over the fence i should say now the master bedroom is um roughly 10 by 10 with space there for your um closet to have your clothes or hang your clothes and we are going back on the outside now to look on the yard space that everybody is here for. Now we are back in the front of the yard um, and we're going to look around the yard now to the left of the building there's not much space um, for that side but let's check out the right now as mentioned earlier the front of the fence is about 10 feet from the front wall of the house and we have all these plants in front to give us a sense of privacy so let's go around the back Now this is what we are here for the yard space it's it's a good size um, space the newer houses in Portmore don't come with this type of yard space so this is, this is what I was making mention of earlier the space to the left so it's a it's a um, irregular shape um, but it's big enough to host a similar structure two bedroom kitchen living and dining right in the backyard and we have this tambourine tree um, not many fruit trees in these whole in these yards anymore because everything is being cut down and turned into a concrete jungle so you have your tambourine tree right there to to go and and, and pick <laughs> whenever you're here let me check this one if there is anything on it oh this one seems to be pretty green so yeah that's definitely green all right guys that is it so we have come to the end of the video so what we're going to do now is recap um the video and just have a quick run through of the property just in case you missed anything um you can come with me to take a look see once more guys while you're here looking through and reviewing or recapping remember to like share and subscribe so i can get some more properties to offer to you guys to sell now this property is going to be listed at 11.5 million um everything should be in the description below number and everything for you guys to reach out um i will be showing a property this weekend which is the 12th of march so if you missed it then guys i promise you it won't be available come monday so call now to book your appointment and guys please 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 be pre-approved before you come to the viewing there is no waiting or guaranteeing because you view the property that you're going to get it so guys remember to like share and subscribe and give me a call